In his tour of foreign countries, the prince had always expressed a strong desire to visit the land of the rising sun. And in 1921, that wish was gratified when the renown reached Yokohama. Everywhere he received a magnificent welcome during a tour packed with happy incident. In South America, four years later, it was the same. At Buenos Aires, eager crowds broke the lines to give him a rousing cheer. His stay in the capital was marked by scenes of the greatest enthusiasm, and from the balcony of Government House he reviewed a military march past. A further chapter was added to his triumphant progress at Montevideo, where the camera recorded an informal moment with the President and other notabilities. San Diego, California, the welcoming crowds were almost the biggest ever seen. There, His Royal Highness was able to indulge his fondness for surf riding, one of the many items in a busy program which the people of San Diego had devised. And if it wasn't the surfboard, it was the added thrills of the surf boat. but sometimes there were solemn duties to perform. We recall the Prince's first visit to the Menin Gate at Ypres, where with 11,000 other pilgrims, he took part in a poignant service of homage to the immortal dead. And again at Brussels, as the guest of the late King Albert. There he paid tribute to gallant Belgium in the unveiling of a beautiful memorial symbolizing Anglo-Belgian unity.